Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. What happens if MCHC count is low? When MCHC levels are very low, your body could struggle to provide enough oxygen to all its tissues. As a result, these tissues are deprived of oxygen and unable to get rid of carbon dioxide. This can actually become life-threatening. What are the problems caused by anemia? Anemia can lead to a rapid or irregular heartbeat, arrhythmia. When you're anemic your heart pumps more blood to make up for the lack of oxygen in the blood. This can lead to an enlarged heart or heart failure. How can I increase my MCH levels naturally? Doctors may recommend that individuals add more iron and vitamin B6 to their diet. Eating vitamin C and fiber, along with foods that contain iron, may also help increase the MCH levels. Supplements for various vitamins are available to purchase online, including vitamin B12, vitamin C, folic acid, and iron. How do you calculate MCHC? It can be calculated by dividing the hemoglobin, in gram per liter, by the RBC count. MCHC measures the average concentration of hemoglobin in the RBCs, and is calculated by dividing the hemoglobin by the hematocrit. Like hemoglobin, the MCHC is reported in gram per deciliter. MCHC, gram per deciliter, equals hemoglobin divided by hematocrit. Take our lead. Let's help you make your mark. 